All right, please ignore the trig on the board, which is for another video. So the question that I'd like to ask you today requires familiarity with the concepts of rational and irrational numbers. And the question is, can an irrational number to an irrational power be a rational number? Once again, can an irrational number to an irrational power be a rational number? This question comes from the famous series of the so-called coffin problems that you can read about on the web. And it's famous, along with all the other problems from that series, for having a very simple and elegant solution that's very difficult to find. Now, I would like to let you know that the general answer to this question is yes, because e to the power of natural log of 2, of course, equals 2. Meanwhile, e is irrational and log of 2 is irrational and 2 is of course rational so what we have is an irrational number to an irrational power is a rational number so the answer is yes it's possible but if this is your answer to the question then the onus is on you to prove that e is irrational and that log of 2 is irrational and I certainly can't expect anyone to remember how to do that I certainly don't remember how to prove that e is irrational and the same goes for log of 2. So you have to come up with a simpler example. You have to use more basic irrational numbers like square roots of numbers that are not perfect squares or roots of numbers that are not perfect powers. And an example like that does indeed exist. And there is one particular element of that example that makes it fascinating. 